Okay. I swear he faked Shireen. What does that mean? Faked Shireen. What, what does that even mean? Please be my spy master, Orphiris. Why won't you be it? You're the only person who actually likes me. Okay, I have to go for more Gil. He's the only guy who actually likes us. Too many vassals right now. We need to give them back to people, I think. There's a lot in the veil that we've got. A lot of Iron Raff. What's going on in Iron Raff? Why are these guys independent, these peasants? Why are these peasants independent? Fake Shireen's death. <laughs> I don't know how I could fake it. She just died. We need to give land back to the Westerlands and the Vale, but we can't because they're too busy. Okay, Davos, I'm going to have to give it to your son. I apologize. Grant landed title. I give you Rain House, Storm's End. Shipbreaker Bay. We'll give him Shipbreaker Bay. So there we go. He gets, the store. he gets that. Shipbreaker Bay. We give him the Stormlands or lower titles. The council does not like it, though. I don't... The council's not happy. No, Davos faked it to save from the flames. We need to change our council a bit. Who's causing problems here? Now, no, they're not really causing that many problems. They still want him to have that. Why? Pragmatist. I want it. So Dav Davos the Onion Knight wants it, so he won't let me give it away. Yeah. So it's, it's da Davos's fault. I can't give it to his son because... Oh, wait. I could just give him that, but not the lower titles. Oh, there we go. Oh, there you go. I could just give him it, but I can't give him the lower titles. Okay, so we'll give his son then... The lower titles. We'll give him Rainhouse. Do they want me to give Rainhouse then? Okay, fine. I'll keep Rainhouse. There you go. Okay. <laughs> All that time. Davos. Welcome back, my good man. Well, you're not back, but still. He'll he'll know. He knows. Hi, Admiral. Uh, and then we need Chief General. Godry Farron will be the Chief General. Then we'll have, as the High Admiral, Godric Langmord. Nope, he won't choose it. John Connington. John Connington, I forgot all about you. Roland Storm, there we go. Perfect. And you can train children. You should be good at that. 15% chance, good. Perfect. Okay. We disturb the news from Stone Dance, another atrocity committed by your bannerman, Lord Pate. Oh no. Pate, Macy, what are you doing? Yay, less people hate you now. Yep, I know. That's what I wanted. Okay, so that looks a bit better then. We got the right vassal limit. We've got the right domain size. Everything looks good. We just need to wait for our vassals to stop their own little wars. He's done there. Kevin's done. He's 100%. Should be finished. You're done, Kevin? Kevin, you're done? Uh, the Vale? You finished yet? You're fighting the Royces? 94% in favor of Yon. Uh, the Bronze. So that's Robert of the Vale. So Harold's claim they're going to push. Okay. We should transfer some vassals to Kevin Lannister. Here you go, Kevin. We're going to give you Crack Call. There you go. I'm also going to give you back the others. Nope, retract. No transfer. I can't transfer any more. Why is that? It needs to be approved by the council. The council doesn't want him to have any more, I guess. Okay, that's fine. Then we're underneath it, at least. So there we go. We just need to wait for the Arons to finish. And we're almost 14. So we're almost getting to the age when we get married to Edric Storm. So Edric Storm and the Girl of Fire will take the Iron Throne. 94,000 men. Time for another winter invasion. And we need revenge on the Freys that killed my sister. The Freys that killed my sister. I have to remember that. If they ever do anything, we will get them. Godry Langward. Okay, John Conton. Nope, still won't. Um, Kevin Lannister? I guess Kevin Lannister. Nope, he doesn't want to be High Admiral. Okay, we have, uh, Erin Florent. Florence always... Yeah, my mum's a Florent. Yeah. Yeah, my mum's a Florent. Probably give it to a Florent. Mel Baratheon has a nice stat. So she's, he's coming out okay. Refuse the quest of Lord Paramount Kevin Lannister. We sworn to him directly. Don't know why. Don't know why they're getting so upset about that. How are you, Pirate King? No vassalization. Well, I want my lands back. We want these lands back. So I declare war upon you, good sir. 
You only have 1,000 men. We're waiting for the Veil to finish, so I'm just going to go to war anyway, because we're waiting for them anyway. Ugh, Sinestral. I guess we'll go for Willis Tyrell. I guess for now, Chief General will be him. Nope, he won't accept. John Connington's only a trained fighter. Garth Greenfield is a skilled fighter. Nope, he won't accept. Uh, Harold Templeton is a skilled fighter. There we go. We'll go for them then. You can train children and you can improve defenses here. We should be able to take this pretty easily. So let's go down there. We'll honor his obligations of the north. So the trident, the stormlands, they're all joining us. Here we go. Convert. Yes. Convert Langwood Hall. Let's go for that for now. Let's get the realms back together. Let's take back um, these lands, the Stormlands. Then we'll go to the Ironborn and we'll take out Uron Crow's Eye. He's still alive at 55 years old. He's still alive and kicking. And so is Victarion, who is now f obviously favored by... He's a dra... What? When did this happen? When did Victarion get the dragon? He got Rhaegal. When did you when did you get that? Victarion, when did you get this? Did you sail over then? You got it? I don't, what the, has Kingsland always seen the light and we didn't even celebrate it? Oh, it's when I did Lightbringer. When I did Lightbringer, um, it converted the whole province. Danny, why'd you let him take the dragon? What about Viserion? No one has Viserion. Okay, that's fine. But still. She has a dragon egg as well. What? Yes. <laughs> yep, Victarion has a dragon, everyone. This could be bad. if we, When we fight the Ironborn, we could have a problem on our hands. We could have a big, big problem on our hands, possibly. The Iron Friends in the state of war. They're on the obligations. What? Mace. I, I gave you a chance, Mace. Mace, we let you bend the knee... In honor of Loris Tyrell. And for stability. And you betray me? You want Greenfield. So this is just a stupid du jour war. You're an idiot. Ours is the Fury. You're an idiot. You do know that, Mace, yeah? You do know you're actually an idiot. Uh, NG, you have the blood of the dragon. You should be able to tame a dragon. I told you to kill Mace. Yeah, I te technically we're descended from Ori's Baratheon. And, of course, our family was married to the Targaryens not so long ago. So, we might have a bit of blood of the dragon in us. No, stay there. Can you pay the gold? We need gold. Oh, we can repay the loan, can't we? Let's repay the loan. There we go. We've got lots of gold now. I should, should have done that a long time ago. Kevin will rebel soon enough. Yeah, they're all going to rebel. Ugh. They're all traitors, if you ask me. All traitors. Let's go to Mistwood. We'll take this. We'll, we'll take this for now. Um, Willis Tyrell. It's not his fault. Imprison him. Bring me his head. It's not his fault. I don't think. Yeah, it's not his fault. We'll leave him there. He doesn't know what his father's doing. His father's insane. He's old and stupid. You know, it's just how it is. It's just how it is. What blood of the dragon does Victorian have? Victorian has... Um, a horn, the dragon horn. So he doesn't he doesn't need anything like dragon blood or anything. The sea dragon. <laughs> Let her rot. So they've gone to King's Landing, which they can't take anyway. So we don't need to be worried. Hoping my vassals come in and help against the Reach. I could just give them. No, they're trying to take Green. No, Greenfield is not theirs. Greenfield is not de jure the Reaches. It is actually. De jure the Westerlands. So yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna give that to them. D Danny got a beautiful new lance, apparently. This would be a time for Danny to attack, to be honest. This would be a time for her to attack. One. Okay, done. Take that. Um inherited city of Plaza Pride. I'll take that. Okay. 18%. We'll go take the capital. Then we'll go defeat his men up north. We'll deal with you, Mace. I'll deal with you once we got our allies to come join us. We need to defeat the Pirate King first. He's more important right now. You're not important at all, Mace. Victorian the Leviathan. Well, I mean, he's quite old. I don't know how long he's going to have that dragon. 
He's 52. He is 52, so I don't know how long it'll last. He is of our religion. Aaron, Aaron Damphair has a dragon egg. Ragel's dragon egg. Well, there you go. That's a uh, good job we didn't give it to Aaron Crow's eye. That would have been bad. He has the dragon bider right now. The dragon horn. Well, good night, NG and chat. I'm going to go hit the hay. Great stream as usual. Thank you, Javils. Thank you for joining us. Hope to see you next time. She took off Willis Tyrell. My wife, my mother, so I didn't trust him, apparently. Which is not a surprise. Who should be Celestial for now? No, we have no Hand of the King. Davos is our only Hand of the King. That's how it is. We'll wait for Davos to come back. What's going on in the Trident? Against the tyranny of God, uh, of against the Giant Slayer. Why is there the Aaron symbol next to the damp pair? What do you mean? Oh, he's, he's in the veil. <laughs> he's gone to the veil, apparently. That's why. There you go. He's gone to the veil, apparently. Apparently, he was kicked out. I guess he was banished by uh, his brother, probably. Danny got a beautiful new glass candle. Okay. I thought that was Danny dying just then. So I got to be like, what? Danny's dead? But it wasn't. Just got a glass candle. There you go. 29%. We've almost got this as well. Sightseeing. Yeah, apparently sightseeing in the veil. Ah. Just sightseeing the veil, taking in the sights, the sounds, the lovely mountains. And Mace has marched 10,000 men up to the green field. Danny has defeated one more of her enemies. She has no more wars. Lincoln, thank you so much for following and welcome aboard. But Danny now has no more wars. What will she do next? What will she do next? Who knows? Will she come to attack us? This would be a good time to attack, to be honest. 52%. Okay, let's go defeat them then. Scheming in King's Lands bore fruit. They want to kill Mr. Florent. Well, that's a shame. Mr. Florent's done nothing wrong. They're taking their men on ships. They're leaving. <laughs> Not a surprise, really. He's going to come check that. Okay, let's stay here then. Wait for them to go there. To see proper education. What will we have then? So, currently we're just willful and religious. So, she loves, she likes to fight. And she's good at fighting. So, we're going to go for a martial education. My father was the hero. So, you know, it makes sense maybe. It does make sense. We're the best education that money can buy, of course. I'm a genius little girl. We need to make sure we get the best that we can get. <gasps> da what? His son died? Of severe stress. It was too much having those new lands. <laughs> and so Davos has got Storm's End. Okay. Well, it looks like uh, Stannis Seaworth is going to inherit. He's married to a Blount who's pregnant. And then next would be Stefan, who is scarred right now. And he's married to a Roller worshipper. Is he Roller? No, they're not Rollers. What? What is wrong with these people? Well, there you go. Poor uh, Seaworth family. Nothing ever goes right. Save for the Seven Uprising over here. But Davos. During my visits to the court, they got me to like the Straits of Tarth. Let's defeat these guys quickly. Go, go, go. Minister Malister arrived at our court. Okay, good for her. Stannis died. I know. 64%. We almost got this. Let's go take this one then. Okay, they're almost getting the King's Landing, so we've got to be careful. We need to win this war quickly, so we go take care of Mace Tyrell. Damn you, Mace. And so the prophecy is fulfilled. Davos never returned. <laughs> Davos never came back. He just went off. He just went off forever. He never wanted to come back, apparently. He just wanted to live on islands, you know? That's all he wanted. He just wanted to go live there. He wanted to go live on Skagos. He wanted to get away. Oh, no. They're sieging down the capital. An enemy host approaches. What do we do? Send my family in the hiding? No. The castle's impregnable. We cannot risk it. We will defend it. Advisor. We'll leave that until after the war's over. Let's raise all our men we can properly get. This war's taking a serious turn now. We need to do this properly. Let's put the men over here. You guys go over here. You go over here. You guys go here. Um, Dragonstone, we have a few men here that need a boat. 
There we go. I'm on a boat, man. It's going fast, man. Uh, pushed off a balcony. Oh, you're talking about Stannis. Yeah, poor Stannis. Pushed off a balcony like the fool he is. Uh, bring those men down here. We'll add them to this one. Any more men that we can see? Okay, 200 men here. We'll bring them up here to join them. 200 men can join them. 800 men up here. Come down this way. Any more random men? Nope, that's it. Okay, let's go back down. Doc's banners for Stannis. Who is LP of the North? Oh, just a random roller worshipper. The guy we put in charge died. And so got inherited by like a, a random guy, I guess. So, not really anything interesting. Kevin's declared Lord of Paramount. Kevin's claim on Stony Sept. We need to defeat the pirate. Pirate King must fall. Before they take King's Landing. Oh, dear, dear. Deary, dear. Okay, 1,000 men here. No, no, go this, no, go this way. Go that way. Okay, good. Me up with these guys. Okay, 800 men here. You'll get picked up by the boat. The boat will come pick you up, okay? Stay there. 2,000 men. Come and join these men. Then we'll send those guys up north. Yeah, we'll send these guys up north. My vassals will go deal with that, I think. Yeah, we can do that. They're coming this way. Good. Okay. Let's see what happens. Melisandre will bring will bring spread the faith. She is the fireborn. Yes, she is. Melisandre is the fire reborn. Twelve years old. We're almost ready to get remarried. Well, to get married the first. We're not not remarried. We haven't been married the first. One. That'd be weird. Um, but we need to get married so we can have babies. That's what we need. We want to have some babies to save the family line. My father would be happy then. Well, happier, you know, if there's actually some heirs. Declared Empress Dany's conquest against Carl Jogo. So Dany's now fighting off the Dothraki. She does have to go against the Dothraki now. She just wants everyone to hate her, apparently. We'll bring them on the ship and we'll take them to here. We'll bring them over to these guys. We've got enough time. You guys come down. Oh, no, come this way. Come this way. It's ended. She's already, she already won that war, apparently. So apparently... No, we're not Shireen. Shireen died. She was killed. Murdered. We cannot order them. Okay, we're going to send these men north. Let's go north. I inherited a castle, which I don't want, but we'll keep it for now. Okay, you come this way. And we'll delete the boats, I guess. Let's delete those boats. These guys are coming down this way. We'll send them up there. Okay, you're still her heir. Murdered by the phrase. Yep. Damn phrase. We'll remember this. He's tutored me these past few months and has been a good teacher. I feel like I know so much more. He gave me more stewardship. Very good. Look at that. Almost all our stats are above 10. That's great. She's going to be a good queen, isn't she? She's going to be a good queen. If you have enough alliances, you can do it. But he, he best strategy is to gain more high lordships. The best advice I can give you... Okay, so I guess that's something else. Losing Seeker 2 isn't bad. It's an experience in the future. Yep. Uh, died in the dungeons, Martin Lannister. These are the people I grew up with. I feel like I bonded with them. I bonded with a lot of people, apparently. Okay, you go that way. We're going to bring all the men together. We should have enough to take them down. And Transfer Room was a fire and blood. Barristan Selmy tried... Barristan Selmy got married to Danny. So Danny married Barristan Selmy at 77 years old. 77 years old. And she gave him a chance to get Viserion. She said, someone stole my other dragon. That Ironborn stole my other dragon. We need to make sure we have two dragons so we can defend ourselves. Here you go, Barristan. Get Viserion. And Viserion killed Barristan. <laughs> he was king for a few days, it looks like. Oh, well. Oh, well. What have you done, Barristan? What have you done? Poor Barristan, sell me. Your grace, the majority population of Stone Dance has been converted. See, people are starting to get converted. The religion spreads. Roller spreads his mighty hand across the lands. It will work. Why, Barristan? Why? Yeah, people are going to be upset, though. It's going to be law of faith for the seven people getting angry. But we don't care. They're stupid. We'll bring you guys down this way. Now go this way. They're almost taking King's Land. We've still got time, though. 
We still got time. We've got a new maester. Ma what? Robert Frey has become my new gr maester. What? What? What is this? What is this? NG, how is Edric doing, my lord? Edric Storm is doing okay. You know, he's just nothing. He's just married to us. He's going to become the king soon once we can get married in a couple of years. Oh, no, 20,000 men now. That's a problem. Okay, we have a problem now. 9,000 men. We've only got 9,000 men. I may need to get higher some people. We can't really get any more. That's it. We're going to have to hire some men, I think. Yeah. We have to hire some men. Oh well, that's going to be a good way to piss off book readers. Have Danny getting embarrassed and killed? I guess you were saying. We'll quit look. Um, have Danny getting it from embarrassed and then he dies. <laughs> okay, nine. We need a lot more men. We need a lot more men, but no one's helping. We need to defeat him first. No, there's a few people who joined us, but it's not enough. Not going to be enough. Um, even if I do get mercenaries, it's not going to be enough. I need the fiery hand. Why can't I hire them? Why can't I hire the fiery hand? I have enough piety. I need them. The poor fellows. Hire for 800. Um, the warrior's sons. 2,250 would not be enough either. He's lean them in King's Landing. His heir, though... Would be Willis. I could just imprison Willis. <laughs> I could just imprison him. That would get 50%. That's a good point. But if he takes King's Landing, he'll get me. Or I could just give up. We could just... We could just uh, surrender. And he will get... Um, he will get Greenfield. That's it. I could just let him have Greenfield. I think that's what I might have to do. We'll see if we can get enough men together. We'll take him down. If not, we'll just let him have um, Greenfield, I guess, instead of the Westerland, which is a shame. And he deserves to be taken down. But there's nothing we can really do about it. Not letting him capture me and let me die. If he could execute me, I might die in the dungeons. We're not letting this happen to my genius door. Plus, it'd be game over because Danny would inherit. So we can't let that sort of thing happen. So we're going to have to make a tough decision, I think. Yeah, 9,000 men plus about 2,000, maybe almost 3,000 just. They're that. We're 12,000. we nowhere near enough. We can't take them down. Yeah. I think we're going to have to just uh, get, make peace of him, I think. Surrender. Okay, fine. I'll surrender. Here you go, Greenfield. Take it. Go on. There you go, have Greenfield. Good, there you go. <laughs> have Greenfield, congratulations. I got some lower prestige, but I got lots of prestige as it is. And we'll go back down south and we'll take this back. Okay, all done. We'll delete these guys. We don't need these guys. Eh, there we go. Okay, fine, here's Greenfield. I'm fine with that. Okay, go. Oh, there's some men here. Men in King's Landing, you sent some sneaky men to go join those uh, the Tyrells, didn't you? You sneaky person, you. Rain waters. You're always a sneaky one. How are you doing? I'm doing fine, Louis. Welcome, welcome. Always good to see you on board. 79%. They're going to bring more men. We'll wait for them to drop them. There's only one ship. So, <laughs> it's only 10 men. There you go. The ship's sailed away without them. Good done. Okay, that's sorted. We head back down south then. What happened to Brienne? Brienne is still alive. Brienne's still alive. She's depressed. She's widowed. She has the sword Oathkeeper still. When she dies, it'll probably go to her brother, Arlen Tarth. But there you go. He is funny and above all, so beautiful. I think I'm falling for Conrad Follard. I'm falling for Conrad Follard. Recruit some giants as your bodyguards. I'll try and talk to him. Well, I am willful, so yeah, I think she would. Conrad and I talked for hours and soon became inseparable. If there was a chore, a homework, or anything we could do together, we did it. If it weren't for my nanny, then we would have slept in the same bed too. Is this is this how it is when you are in love? Ah, oh, look at that. 
What a lovely little girl. What a lovely girl. She's just so sweet, isn't she? Okay, 44 men. Go take care of them. They've got low morale. Can they get there in time? <laughs> Did they? Oh, victory. We just got a ton of men there at the same time. Go defeat them here. They'll stop. Yep, then we'll go there and we'll take them out. 83%. We'll go assault this. 92%. Just need to take that and it's done. How's Brienne doing? I just looked at Brienne. She's fine. She has her Oath Keeper still. She's, keep, she's just keeping to herself in her older age, you know? She was upset when her husband died. And since then, she decided not to get remarried. So, tending the wounds. Very good. 96%. After this is done, it's just the Ironborn. And of course, the, uh, the dragon. The dragon that they have. Bastards are coming in the near future. Possibly. <gasps> Victorian has been exiled. What? Victorian Greyjoy was exiled to the wall with his dragon. So when we face the Ironborn, they'll have no dragon. What are you doing? What are you doing, Victorian? I guess he couldn't trust him. He couldn't trust his brothers, so he exiled both of them. Well, there you go. Ash is still there. Oh, well, that's fine by me. I don't, I'm not bothered by that. <laughs> There's not going to be a dragon there. Makes things easier for me, so. Six days. Assault. Oh, we couldn't get it. Damn it. I thought maybe they could do it, but it wasn't enough. Assault. There we go. 100%. And the lands have been returned. There we go. Look at that. The lands are back where they should be. Take that, pirate king. You fool. Delete them. Okay. We got that all done. Now what's this? Army up north. We got an army up here. Okay, fine. They were defeated, apparently. The fools fight amongst themselves. So no smart victim would have usurped him. <laughs> The wars are over. So now we just got one thing left. Just Victoria. Um, just to Uron. I was thinking Victorian just then. Council. We need a new council. Okay, advice. No. Sinestral. Um, Davos Seaworth will always be it. Justice Sir will go to. We do like varies. But then Duran Martel, he's been good. He doesn't want it, apparently. Okay, well, I'll go with varies then. Advisor. Will be... Nope, he doesn't want it. Kevin Lannister? Nope. Uh, Mace Tyrell? Nope. Okay, none of them want to be on the council. We go for Macy. There we go. Macy will be our advisor then. Fine. Done. My lord, we take Wildlands as vassals? You'll probably delete you. There we go. Done. We've got 2,000 more special event troops left. That's it. And let's get you resigned. There we go. Done. Perfect. Okay. So everything's set now. Everything looks good. Apart from the trident being at war, the Brackens have also converted. Everyone's converting. Everyone is converting. What is this war? Against the tyranny. Yeah. So if he were to lose, it would go to Brian Farron. The Farrons would still keep it, but it would go to someone else. Gorta Chester. I don't really need to worry about him. I don't think it's going to be a problem. Okay, done. Anything else that we need to do? Upgrade the Holden. No, I don't want to do that right now. We don't want to upgrade Rain We don't care about Rain House. I want to give it to Davos, but he can't take it because he's too busy being missing right now. He's always missing. Always missing. Always missing. Okay, taken as a prisoner, Miss Lady Bright. Poor Lady Bright. Declared Westland a golden tooth du jour war. I'm fine with that. That is actually their land, so it makes sense. How many men does he have? 19,000 men. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. My council. Should we go and fight the Iron King before my wedding? I'm 13 right now. We've got a few more months before we get married. Should we go fight the Ironborn now, or should we wait till after the wedding? What, do, what does my council think? What does the council think? I think Rainhouse to John Connington and put him under Davos. You know what? Maybe I will. You always forget about John. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. No. Take the Iron Isles. No. Once he dies, they'll have less troops. Yes. 
Let's try and find John Connington. There we go, John Connington. Maybe he can't have kids. They won't let me give it to him. The council doesn't want me to give it to him. Um, Pirate King should be the first target after... We took out the Pirate King. Well, I mean, we took out we took our lands back. He's just his own stepstone thing. Take the Iron Isles. We want to smash. Kill them. Put them in the dirt. Less war, more smashing. Or shouldn't we declare war and then we can smash? Because we'll get married then. Okay, I, I, the counts seem to be a bit divided on that. So let's do it then. We'll declare war. Honor their obligations, everyone. There we go. Davos has honored his obligations. Let her rot. Uh, Mace and Duran Martell are not joining, though. Only Davos is coming to help. That's it. The others never come to join. Liberation of the North, 60%. Oh, dear. That's not good. Burn them in the name of the Lord of Light. We shall. 26,000 men. Get some boats ready. Okay. Bring them over here. How many boats do you give us? Eight. You give us eight boats. Okay, fine. Delete these. <laughs> Delete them. Then we'll get all these men together. And we'll get our boats to come to Dragonstone. We'll get the Dragonstone men. Delete these. Delete this. Delete the men we don't need. Okay. A far away, maybe, or something. You know, anything like that. Um, we'll take the ships around, get the men from... Um, Castly Rock, and we'll take them over as our main army. That's what we're going to do. We get the boats together. 24th of July should be the time we assault. The honor the obligations. Duran Martell is joining. Okay, Duran Martell is actually going to join, and that's good to see. And what is this? A marriage. Syndra. Our oh, Roland Storm is dead. Fine, I don't care. You can have her. What's going on in the Vale, my lord? Uh, they're just kind of civil war. Robert Aaron, you know, Robert Aaron is just up here. He's fighting a war against uh, the Runestone uh, for Harold's claim on the Vale. Currently, the Royces are winning, uh, winning, but it's been like that for a long time. And he's now married to a Jordan. She's now taken Varys off the council. She never likes Varys. She never likes Varys. Put them together. Put them on the boats, and we'll sail them round. To Castly Rock. Here we go. Let's go. And all the men are coming into here. Yeah, but they'll protect King's Landing for now. We only probably need these men from uh, the Westerlands to defeat them. That's probably all we need. Euron Greyjoy, you will bend the knee to the true queen. I am the fiery born. The queen Melisandre Baratheon. My father was the man who won the war for Dawn. He may have not lived to the end of it, but he declared it and he won it by uniting the realms once again. It was only thanks to him we survived. And Robert Aaron died of a poor physique, so it doesn't matter. Harold Aaron is now the new Lord Paramount. Well, there you go. That sorted out that situation. Wait, 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 wait a second. Shireen? Her name's Shireen? What? What the? What's going on? Alright, the boats will get there soon. He'll get his men around here, probably. And we tried to revoke some land from some people, and that's not made people happy. So he's facing now against his tyranny. A lot of people are joining against it. People don't like him. If he loses, it will go to his son, Lord Florian Aaron. A young boy. It'll be hard to control that. Let's go. Shireen faked her death. <laughs> uh, okay. Can we actually intervene? The Regency. I'm in the Regency, so the Council will decide. We can take 7,000 men. So. Let's just go through and see what we can get. That's probably enough. Okay, we'll put them on the boat. And let's go. Go straight there. Davos is already there with some men. Um, we've got enough men to protect King's Landing. The council voted against. Okay, there we go. Shireen is chilling with Davos. <laughs> They're not really dead, yeah. Lufa Florent and Elise Florent. Okay, fine. Yeah, I'm fine with that. They're with the same dynasty. The Florents are my mother's house, so, you know, we have nothing really objecting to that. Okay, who's going to lead these men? 
What commanders do we have? We need more commanders. Brian Farron. Kevin Lannister. Asalo. We've got Orphary Sunglass and Erin Florent. Well, there we go. We'll put in charge then John Connington. Brian Farron. And Kevin Lannister. Because it's, it's mostly his men, to be honest. We're straight to the capital. We'll take him down. We'll take them all down. He's going to land his men straight on top of mine. So we need some defenders then. Gullion, you will defend with this former slave, Asalo, and my Lord Commander. Can't wait to burn Uron. He probably. And the marriage can begin. It is done. We marry Edric Storm in celebration during the Battle of King's Landing. Look at that. There we go. King Edric Storm and Queen Melisandre Baratheon. Plenty of gold. Ugh. Let's give the customary amount. Then rot. Mance Raider is still in jail. To be <laughs> Instead of more men, they're going to be also down. But can we just hold on? And there we go. It is one. We captured Donna Salt Cliff. Good job, everyone. Woodmere, chase them down. I stand head and shoulders above the other children, and why should I pretend otherwise? Edric's stats are terrible. Yes, they are. He's bankrupting us again, and we've still got quite a bit of money. So I've gained proud. Let him rot. Yeah. So we're now a proud little girl. We're proud and zealous. So, yeah. Hmm. Okay. Chase after them while they've got low morale. How about we send these men over here to help out? Because I think these guys can take care of this situation. Yeah, I think they can probably take care of this. They, they can capture Pike. We'll send the boats to Castley Rock. Hating this Edric. Edric, Storm. Okay, we've got similar morale. And they've got more men. And they've got to go across the river. So we're going to leave that. I've gained stubborn. So, Varys has made me a stubborn person. We need those 10,000 men. Let's bring them across. Oh, they, did they put them on the ship again? Did they just put them on the ship again? Yeah, I think they did. I think, okay, good for me then. Okay, tap me by that way. I'm fine with that. They did that. Look at that. What fools. What fools they be. Hey everyone, how you doing? Good to be here. Hello, Scottish Wolf. Welcome aboard. Good to see you around. We need to continue the war. Okay, there we go. This will be the la this is the last thing we need, guys. Once this war is done, the lands are basically all back together. So it'll be a great day for everyone. We'll chase these guys down. Only 5,000 men there. Greenfield was beheaded. Oh dear. Danny won her war. Uh, no, similar amount of men. They got them together in time. Pull back, pull back. Get the 11,000. And what's this? The Grand Maester Gain has been tutoring me the past few months. And has been a good teacher. I feel like I know him much more. And I have gained patient. Your high priest is called Grayscale. Oh no. That's not good. We're now a patient girl. A patient, stubborn, proud, and zealous. Ugh. She's definitely going to be quite into her roller religion. We are helping our silly Lord NG to rule the Seven Kingdoms. Edric, we need a baby. We need a genius strong baby. I need 10 intrigue. Then we got everything at 10. The coffers. Hmm. I guess it's not really. Selyse is in charge. Yeah, Selyse probably is like Stannis about this. Yeah, it's their duty. I, f I feel she's kind of like Stannis on that most likely. We're taking Pike. It's taken a long time though. She's super set in her ways, yeah. Let's hope the phrase die. <laughs> Put the men together. Okay, Lord Commander, take the men and go. Take them down. The Grand Maester is dead, it looks like. The Grand Maester has died, I think. To end his war, okay. Yeah, no, uh, I need a new Maester. Where's the new Maester? Coming under threat, it's my duty. We'll protect our people. 21,000, go Lord Commander. Okay, we've got Zarbello. He's actually really good. Look at him. 
He is really good. Should we get him? To, do I need varies? Varies is good. I guess varies is good. He's also zealous, actually. That's kind of funny. We're both zealous about the religion. There we go. And they're take if he had that dragon, this could have been a lot more difficult, but they did not. They did not have the dragons. If only he'd not sent Victarion to the wall, you know? Who is Lord Commander? I want Victarion to become Lord Commander. That's what I want. <laughs> that would be great to see. It's not changed, though. It's only 5%. Shouldn't take too long. If we take Pike, it should be over. We'll defeat this army here. Protect my vassals. You better run away. Where are they going? Sharp point. They're going to wend water. Okay, we're going to fight them there. 2,000 men. Let's go. Defeated. This will come to an end. Okay. As rule the veil. Okay. So let's though he was defeated in that war for tyranny. So now Harold Aaron's son is now taking over Florian Aaron. His mother was Shireen. Okay. Bit of a mess up there in the veil, but, you know... Nothing we can do about that. You know, we don't really care, to be honest. Defeat them. Go down here, defeat them. Just need to take Pike. Pike must fall. Once Pike has fallen, the war is over. Oh, what the? The trident just went into a weird shape. <laughs> okay, I guess. Okay. He. Did he die? Was he killed? What happened? Did he lose the war? He died in that. Oh, Godry the Giant Slayer died a natural death. His family member, who also controls this, Brian family. He's got the right religion, though, so I guess we're okay with that. He's now in charge. Okay. Ugh. Why do Restoros bother with boring seven-faced god? E well, okay. NG dodged something. Still got the men up there. Okay, those guys went to the fight on their own, which is kind of a silly idea, probably. We defeat them here, though. 100% done. See, we saved Macy's hook. Macy's hook is okay. Rest in peace. What? Rest in peace what? What's going on? I'm fine. Nothing's wrong. We're okay. We saved Macy's hook. Good to know. Look at us. Look how great we are. We're only 14 years old. I need a baby. Come on, Edric. Put a baby in us. He ransomed. Oh, Lance or Lannister is now the Lord of the Westerlands. Oh, he died of gonorrhea. Okay, and he has Widow's Wail. So Widow's Wail still exists. Rest, oh, rest in peace, Godry. Okay, makes sense. Sorry. Gilbert Lannister is next in line. Pike has fallen. We've got this. It's all, it's all done, really. It's all done. This war is over. Everyone in Greyjoy, you will bend the knee to me. Is Edric a commander? No, I don't think so. Um, the Lord Paramount just died in suspicious circumstances. Someone assassinated him. So now Harold Aaron is now Lord Paramount again. He does have Oswin Aaron still. And a bastard son. And a bastard daughter. Well, well, well. What an odd thing going on up there. Marjorie Tyrell just died of cancer. She had two kids. Ah, it's a shame. And look who it is. It's Melisandre Baratheon. She looks up. You can see a bit of her mother there. There's a lot of her mother there, but she's got the stern eyes of her father. Look at that. The stern face of her father. Woo, go Harold. Okay, 75%. We just need to take that. That's it. And it's done. We're fine. We're fine. We're secure. Ah. She died prego. Ah, oh, Godry. We barely knew ya. Ah, she's pretty. And she has her father's crown, of course. Of course we do. Of course we do. Me and Edric Storm, strong and genius together, will bring the realms peace and prosperity, as we know. We'll increase the speed. What the? Wait, 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 wait. This is very unusual. And what happened to Pentos? What happened to Pentos? King Brian... The Imperious, Marion. The Andals are back, baby. The Andals managed to take over Pentos. I don't know how they did it. And they've got the ship Victory, which they took from 
the Lords of Pentos. That is crazy. I've never seen the Andals do that. Wow. Tyrosh did have a thing to go and take over, invade some foreign lands, but they never did it. I guess we should have a look at the rest of the world, yeah. Oh, what the? Okay. Okay, Danny has built her own empire, the Empire of Giscar. <laughs> and she's now got remarried to another Miranese. She decided, she decided to stick to Marine, I guess. What an odd situation. Victorian's still alive on the wall as well. Imagine if he betrays the Night's Watch and goes beyond the wall with his dragon. We had Danny, and she's taken over all this. She's taken over North Valyria. What an odd situation this is right now. Conquest of Lazosh. She's now conquering them. She has gone full on just conquering her own destiny, but she has no kids. She has no kids. She's not pregnant. She's 33. She's going to need to get some kids. Um, it's very hard, though, for her to have kids. And what's going on in Yi T? Conquest of the Five Forts. Okay, not a big thing really going on there. Okay, we'll go back over. A few weird things going on at the moment. A few weird things going on right now. Victorian for the Night King. <laughs> but yeah, a few odd things going on in the rest of the world. No matter how many questions I ask, it varies always as an answer. This will be good. This will be good to me. I have no lover, actually. I know what I can do, and I have no reason to be afraid of anything. We are brave. There we go. Melisandre is a brave young girl. 16 martial. And she's got 17 learning. Deeply hesitant. Money is your duty. I'm stubborn and proud. You must serve me for the realm. The employee of Lord Bath. Okay, so Robert Strong. Wait, wait. Robert Strong? It's Gregor Clegane. Yes, come join me. Okay. <laughs> so I've now... F I didn't even realize he was still alive. Oh, God, look at that. So it looks as though Cersei's little pawn is still alive. And he's now... Where was he? Was he in bronze? Was he working for Bronn? Well, I guess I want to make him a uh, member of the King's Guard. Do we have all the King's Guard filled up? Let's have a quick check again. Yeah, we do. Okay, we're going to keep him. I'm going to make him a King's Guard member if we get one open. He's 52, though. Um, but he'll be a formidable fighter, strong, giant. He'll be impossible. A mercenary. Now oh, we don't need a mercenary company. He'll be with us for now. Um, he can be my bodyguard, yeah. Well, I guess the King's Guard is my bodyguards, aren't they? So we can't really be it. That's a shame. That's a shame. But we'll leave him for now. Good to have him on board. He'll become a King's Guard once one dies. Hopefully one does die soon then. It'll be a shame for him to die before them. And the war's over. Uron Greyjoy. Time to bend the knee. There you go. And we've brought the realms together. And I'm not even 16 years old. We had a few more months until I take on the role of the thrones. So the thrones now all brought together. I took the Driftwood crown. We'll delete them. Delete them. Oh, we lost the event troops. Oh, well. Oh, well. Delete everyone. Everything's back to peace. Uh, reappoint the old council. Intervene against the aggression of a person. The council voted against. Take that. Robert Strong for gold cloaks. You're the best bastard an advisor could wish for. <laughs> Stannis would be poor. I'm pleased for the majority of the population of Sweetport. Stannis has been converted. More people are being converted. See, it's all going to plan. Stannis' legacy lives on in me, his daughter. If only I had more intrigue, that would have been good. If I could have got over 10 intrigue, I'd be quite happy. Hand of the King. Davos, of course. Master of Arms is Robert Strong, apparently. Uh, Justice Sir will be Davos, but he won't accept it. We'll go with Willis Tyrell, then. Improved, no, uh, oversee the realm. Train children, 19%. Okay, try and get me something just before I get too old, because I have nothing. I can't, I can't fight, apparently. So, yeah, I can't fight. So, I can do lots of things. I just can't really fight. One-on-one, -on -one, 
Rob has been converted. Maester Rob. Okay, good for you, Maester. Welcome aboard. What the? <gasps> the Damn it! Okay, so in the north, it looks like the rebellion won, and they freed themselves. Mr. Elwood Redwick lost enough, and instead of going underneath me, they became free. And so Roderick Riswell, he freed the north from the tyranny of the Rodo religion, and now he's got his own land. So there's a free north. We need to put it down. We need to put it down. If only I had someone who had a claim to the north. Sansa. Now, Littlefinger's dead, but she got remarried to a grove. And she still has not had a, a son. She's 30. Get a divorce. <laughs> Get a divorce, please. I want to bring her to my land. It is matrilineal. Oh my god. Invited to court. Oh, we need to get Sansa him. We need to push her claim. Yes, we do. We need to push Sansa's claim and give her the North. That's what we should. She's a faith of the seven. We can give her the North. We'll do this in honor of Jon Snow, who was the Lord Commander when the Night's Watch fell. He died fighting the White Walkers. And also, of course, Eddard Stark, you know? We should do it for them. Plus, she has a claim. Long claw she has. How am I going to get her here, though? She hates me and my false religion. I send her a gift. Will that help? Not really. The false religion thing doesn't help. What about her husband? Yeah, I can't invite him. Has to invite her. Ha. Huh. How am I going to get her to come to us? Point to the king's guard. Let's do that. <laughs> <laughs> Only I could just declare war for her anyway. That'd be great, but I can't. I guess I could try and take it and give it to her. Let's wait till I'm 16. We'll wait till I'm 16 and we'll take the north. The north will fall and we'll wait for the reach and try to finish their wars. Then we'll go take back the north. So the wars continue. It's not over just yet, guys. The wars are not over. Westeros is still not back to normal. <sighs> I thought I'd finally had a chance of winning a friendly duel during the sword training. My opponent clearly wasn't as comfortable with a sword as I was. And I'd read our teacher's treatise through and through several times. But all his unease, my opponent showed he knew what end of a sword you're supposed to hold. And I lost once again. Good game. How dare you, sir, have gained a new rival this day. I'll defeat you tomorrow. She's brave. She's patient. Yeah, I think she can say I'll defeat you tomorrow because she's patient. And she's proud. So she knows she'll beat him. She's like, I know I can beat him. I'll beat him tomorrow. <gasps> okay, not me. Got gay, got grayscale. Okay, that's fine. My young subject, Solaire Whitehead, got incompetent commander. November will be the month for we become a woman grown. Nowhere of the dynasty either. Empress Daenerys Stormborn has won another battle. She's still trying to conquer more lands. Look at that. Dan is just complete. She doesn't care about the Iron Throne. She doesn't care about the Iron Throne. All Baratheons have black hair, but unless I'm just blonde hair. I don't think it's necessarily that all them have to have black hair. Remember J Street? Like, the genetics aren't exact. It just seems very suspicious. Like, because they had three children and all of them are blonde of hair, it was particularly suspicious. I think that was more the point. It doesn't mean they have to be. It's just Baratheons tend to be very black of hair. That's all. That's how I see it. But we're touched by fire, remember? We are the embodiment of fire. I have been touched by fire. It's perfect. It's just black hair touched by fire. That's all. That's all. Grand Mace has been tutoring me these last past few months. We gained two diplomacy. Look at that. 16 diplomacy, 16 martial. Very good. Yeah, he's back in charge now of the veil. Westerlander du jour war. Do you visit to my court? Okay. There are lots of things going on. Seeks to kill them? Okay. Your Grace High Garden has been a trial by combat. You wait for these wars to be over. Master of Laws, Justice Sir. I guess Valerian? Monteries? Bruce Buckler? Let's go for Monteries. Nope, he doesn't want it. Okay. Varies. Let's go for Varies. Welcome back, Varys. Welcome back. My lord, the stream new theory is that Melisandre is my bastard. T Everyone's your bastard, apparently. Voting in favor. 
Stannis Seaworth seeks to kill Devon. Of course, I'll obey. Thank you, Lancel. Lancel Lannister. How does Lancel Lannister always get involved? I thought he said you two could get married. Yeah, get married. Get married. I guess it was just a betrothal before. Ugh. Bellic Whitehead is currently in my captivity. Keep them there. We need people we can burn in the future. Though I wouldn't mind the 14 gold. Let's get that gold. Ah, is there any black fires left? No, there's not. Ah, oh, my mother. The regency's over. Thank you. But I become a brilliant commander. Look at this. Look at Melisandre. Compare her to... She's just like her father. In fact, she's better than her father. Melisandre Baratheon. What will the future hold for her? I think there's great things in store for her. If only she could become chosen by Rollo as well. That would be perfect.